Creating AI video in 2024, you need a level labs, mid journey, hey gen, ChatGPT, and editing software. That's all very expensive and not convenient to use. Meet AI Studios, an all-in-one solution for AI avatars, voice cloning, AI video and images, automated video creation, and much more. Ready to simplify your workflow and save some money? Let's dive in. Here is the starting page of the service. As you can see, it looks very familiar to you because it looks like a Canva. And you know what? I do like it because in majority of cases, companies trying to reinvent the wheel. And this is not a good idea. Here is our different tools for you, like avatars, voices, AI generators, and so on. Uh, we will cover it a little bit later. Here are also a templates for different user cases, like uh, education and training, YouTube, TikTok, business, commerce, news, and so on. Also important that you can choose different aspect ratios, like web page and mobile. We will start uh, with the new project. I think it would be more interesting. Go to avatars page. There are a lot of different realistic avatars with different appearance, clothes, and even haircuts. And I'm sure that you will be able to find uh, the best option for you. But if you surprisingly want, there is also a feature of creating AI avatars based on you or also based on any image you like. What is also really nice that you can click on any avatar in order to see and hear how your avatar looks and sounds. My name is April, and I am an avatar developed by Deep Brain AI. Let's make a video together. Okay, well, for example, this was an April. I will prefer uh, this one. Uh, let it be Hayden. Hi, I'm Hayden, one of the many avatars available from Deep Brain AI. Choose a template and let's get started. As you can see, she looks very natural. And I do like her t-shirt. It looks the same like a Iron Man t-shirt in a Avengers, I suppose. But anyway, let's try this model. Press this button here. And as I mentioned earlier, here is a very familiar interface. There are different templates available right here on the left and different models, text, captions, media, and even uh, shapes and generate options for generating images or video. Let's start with avatar. We can easily edit the position of the avatar, also change the scale. There are ability to generate voice only right here. So let's try to generate anything. We can enter our text right here, but also we can generate text using AI script assistant. This is a killer feature, which I do like it. And uh, let's take something absurd. For example, tell me about a cat deportation problem. Uh, why not? Well, we just generated our text and this looks very <laughs> plausible, I suppose. In case of the problem, we can easily regenerate the text by pressing this button here, but it looks very nice, so let's apply this text. Press apply button here. And now we can um, generate a video with this text, but I think it's too much for one scene. So let's take only one sentence. And here we are gonna change a scene with another avatar. First of all, I think we need to change the background. Let's press the media. As I mentioned earlier, you can generate any image uh, right here. You can also generate a video. But this feature is experimental, still nice to have, especially now. Uh, let's take uh, something from the media library. Right here, we can find any image uh, in a sh shutter stock, which is free if you have upgraded plan. Uh, let's take something from Pixabay. Let it be something with deportation. This looks nice. Unfortunately, there is no cats, but Anyway, uh, we can change uh, the position of the layer. Mm, press right button here and layer position to bottom. That's great. And let's make it looks a bit more natural by adjusting the opacity. Okay. There are also a feature, scene speed. Some avatars might support gestures, but exactly this one, the hidden, unfortunately doesn't support gestures. Not a problem. What is really nice is that we can add effect right here to the text. For example, if we wanna to see an effect on this word, for example, let it be invasive species. 
we can use any effect right here for example let it be a bulb why not and we can change the position of this uh, effect there is also ability to add pause you can change uh, the length of the pause for example the half of the second uh, let add the pause between sentences but there is only one sentence anyway uh, let's add pause somewhere here also there is ability to use dictionary and personalization tag i actually don't know how it works but probably we will find out a little bit later uh, let's change the next slide right here for example let's take only one sentence here and as i mentioned earlier you can also uh, change uh, the avatar let it be this one and also let's change the image uh, from the media here is our iron which will also present some text about the cat deportation problem and let's change uh, the opacity of this layer there is also actually the animation so let it be animation with fade in uh, let's start the third scene and I'm gonna show you something interesting. Here you have ability to add several speakers right here in this uh, scene. It's very convenient and important if you have more uh, complicated interaction. And this ability is very cool because I've never seen uh, such instrument before. Of course you can do that using HeyGen and uh, DaVinci Resolve for example. But just imagine how complicated it would be. In this case, it's very convenient. Uh, we can also add our pre-recorded audio, or you can record audio right here using your microphone. But more interesting that you can just use your own voice. Because you can use voice cloning feature right here. Just press voice cloning button and press mic and to read the text, which we will see. And that's it. Very simple. Press voice synthesize. Just after 20 seconds, we uh, synthesize our audio and we can check how it sounds. Hello, I am a virtual human created using deep brain TTS technology and avatar technology. That sounds really nice and very natural to my mind. But I would say that this guy has a little bit better accent, but that's even better. So uh, let's press confirm my audio and now we can synthesize the text using my voice. Uh, but let's change the avatar and let it be, let it be this, uh, this Michael and let's add some uh, image here. All right, I think we've just finished our project. We can also add captions. There is such ability. You can add the text right here. We can easily add text also right here. So let it be also the same text and let's add text right here and right here we can animate it just let it be fade in so finally let's export our project press export button here here we can see how many uh, credits we will spend so there is uh, almost one minute video and we will spend uh, 077 credits that's nice we can choose uh, any video quality Unfortunately, the most coolest features is not available right here. There should be ability to change the language of the project. And the service automatically translates your video to any language you like. And this feature is just a very cool. But unfortunately, at this moment it's not available, as I understand, due to changes in the uh, user interface. But this will be fixed in the next several days. So let's finally press export button. Now we are processing our video. It should take about several minutes. We just finished our project and let's view the video. The cat deportation problem refers to instances where cats are removed from certain areas or countries due to various reasons, such as public health concerns, environmental impacts, or invasive species management. For example, some islands have implemented cat deportation to protect native wildlife, as feral cats can threaten bird populations. This issue raises ethical questions about animal rights, the effectiveness of such measures, and the responsibilities of pet owners. Solutions often involve humane relocation, sterilization, and public education to manage cat populations responsibly. Uh, first thing I noticed that there is a pause in the video which we added before. And this is, looks very, very natural, especially with Hayden. Uh, the second guy looks okay, and uh, the third one is different because it has 
the background which we deleted before and there are some artifacts but not so noticeable at the same time if we will use video with a green screen the result will be much better also i surprised that the effect has also an audio nice to have so i do like it another very cool feature is url to video you can generate video based on url or even based on different documents I've just pasted a random link to the video. For example, I took Master of Puppets music right here. And surprisingly, it generates a video about Metallica and Master of Puppets song. As you can see, uh, it generated also an images specifically for the topic. We can also change some uh, parameters with different languages. There are a lot of different languages. You can also change uh, the model of your avatar. Ever wonder why Metallica's Master of Puppets still hits hard decades later? Let's dive in. What is also important is that we are creating a video right here. It's processing automatically, but uh, it's not spending our credits because we are not uh, export this video. This is a very cool feature and it allows you to save a lot of credits and pay only for what you really like. Well, the initial processing of the video has been finished and now we can edit our video right here in a, the same uh, editor which we saw before. It works in the same way as the previous one. Uh, the video, the final video will be available after the export of your project. There are a lot of really cool features. Very important to my mind is marketing features, which allows you to generate video from URL, which we covered before, but also you can generate video from docs by creating video messages. You can take any document in any format like PDFs uh, for PDF files, PPT for uh, Microsoft presentation, PowerPoint, uh, also Excel files are is applicable, and all of them will be automatically processed and translated through your uh, video with AI avatar. This looks like a pure magic to my mind. If you have any problems uh, with, with understanding of the service, uh, with service usage, you can easily use uh, the help page. There are a lot of information about the service about all tools available right here. But as I mentioned earlier several times, it's exceptionally easy to use, even without any instructions. Let's discuss uh, the price of this service. There are different plans, personal, team, and enterprise. In case of personal team, the price is $24 per month for 15 minutes of video. Uh, it includes uh, one seats and all AI avatars and a lot of key features. It might look quite expensive, but the price is very reasonable. If you have any business and you have a lot of uh, work to do with uh, video creation, you understand how expensive all these processes are. And you can substitute a lot of people by this service. Many of the process just automated by AI. What is also important that you are paying only for the video, the final video which you approved and which you like. These 15 minutes will be uh, the pure content which you will generate using this service. So in this case, the price in $24 per month seems very, very reasonable to me. And in case of team plan, there'll be available Shutterstock and after caption, which is a very essential features. Thank you for watching this video. I hope that you find this video helpful and bye-bye.